Welcome to today's video. We're gonna go and get some inner tubes. Someone has saved the day. A guy called Tron. We're heading to his bike shop now. So just as a precaution this morning, we're heading to this guy's shop um, to pick up some long valve inner tubes. Just so we've got a few more. We're also gonna check out what tires he's got in stock because my rear one after that punchy yesterday. There's a huge car right across it and the boot keeps moving around and stuff. So we'll see. If he's got something appropriate, I might switch out tires. Maybe some thick slicks like James has got. This is a cool place, isn't it? We're then gonna get the bikes packed up together, try and find a ferry, and finally get to Halong Bay. Still a fair bit of riding to do today. A little bit of riding. We haven't. It's not like 50k. Okay. That's a ride. Yeah, just getting okay. out of this city takes anything oh. as long as Halloy. The road bike. Pretty sure this bike shop is a guy's house. It's cool though. It is really cool. But I mean, like, he's got carbon mountain bike. The actual S works. Is it? I'll have to say, innit? Got you some Hutchinson nitros. Mate. Nitros. His dad's shop is next door. Amazing. It's basically what Pearson Cycles looked like about five years ago. You yeah. cut by isolate and yeah. you cut high isolate. Yeah, cut high isolate. Have a long wrist for like. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, so we're leaving Haiphong today, heading towards the sea, and then getting a ferry to Halong Bay. A little bit of a ride on the other end as well. Traffic doesn't look as bad as Hanoi. Yesterday we were pretty nervous when it came to tackling the traffic in the cities. Waking up this morning though, you're kind of just in tune with it and you know what to expect and I don't know, something's happened to our brains and we're just a lot more relaxed. In some sort of weird way, it just works. Quick water stop. I think that we've got like a gallon of water or it didn't cost very much. And like a crowd of people. They really do look after you here. No, made in Taiwan. Yeah. So we just spotted a cash point um, as we're leaving the city. Thought it might be a good idea to stock up on some cash because I'm not really sure if Halong Bay is going to have any cash points. The bay might, where we're staying definitely won't because it's a floating hotel or something. The whiskey lives to see another day. I was tired last night. I only had a little bit. Structure in Vietnam, which is just not really used. I mean, take this road for example, three lanes, massive hard shoulder, only us on it. About 10 miles till we get to the ferry now. I've got a splitting headache. A little bit dehydrated. It's really hard to keep on top of with the humidity. Just downed a whole bottle of water. Feeling a bit better. Mountains in the distance. See that over there? Mountains, man. Badass. Sweet. That for us as well. Do you want to swap it? You can have a bike if I can have one of your mopeds. He said no. Ah, oh, very nice. Much better than this one. It's got panniers on it and everything. Yes. Washing machines. Nice yes. washing machine. Yeah. Got a Ferrari bike. Ferrari bike. Ferrari, very good. It was 36,000. So ferry. you thought it was a tenner for all three of us, but it's £1.20. It's cost us 40p each to get here. That's unbelievable. <laughs> Cyclists' arms. He's just saying that um, he's pointing at your tires and going at your rear tire and going, no good for where we're going. Oh no. What are the chances? You bastard. You've probably never seen someone fix a puncture so quickly. What do you think? It's nice? Twa. Not nice. No, no, no. Uh, you fall off of it and you hurt yourself. <laughs> Welcome to Cat Bar Island. We've got about 15 miles to ride on this side. Apparently there's a guy on the boat was saying there was a little bit of off-road. I managed to get another puncher. This time it was just a normal puncher. A bit of swath from a truck or something. Found the piece and we'll patch up the tube. It's just bad luck. Positive waves, man. Love cycling. Positive waves. Almost there. Well, I'm hoping, having had almost two days of riding on freeways, I'm hoping this is going to be quite nice.
Are you enjoying the heavy bike? Oh man, I'm starting to seriously regret my life decisions. It's really heavy, man. <laughs> and there isn't even a croissant at the end. I know. I've got half of one in my bag still, so it's all good. So the plan is, we get another boat in a minute after eating our body weight and food and drinking our body weight beer. I'm not ready for a beer yet, my head hurts. I'm I am mad. always ready for a beer, as long as all of the cycling is done. This is where we find out we can't get a boat and we have to go back. So there's a hotel there. <laughs> That's the most unappetizing hot bag I've ever seen in my entire life. It's square. Can you imagine if we'd done all of that, we'd have got here the other day, in the dark, in the rain. I, I admit it was optimistic. This is silly. <laughs> Who's going in the drink? Whose bike's going in, mate? Get on the boat! This is the nuts. I love this shit, mate. stresses and angst of the last two days have been worth it for this. So check this out. Come and look at this. See the ripples in the water? Those are the fish that we're, I mean, I'm going to eat. You're definitely not going to eat them because you always vegan. Oh my goodness. Happy water is what it's been described as. One more? Yes. Okay. Oops, sorry. Four. Beer? Oh, it's all right, actually. You're making a meal of eating. I like the tiny bowl thing. You are a tiny man. I might get so. some tiny bowls for home. 